What up YouTube, this is Supercharged iOS and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to update the firmware on the Armada Mach 8. Now a couple things you're going to need to do this, you need a standard size SD card and you'll need either a toothpick or a matchstick or something similar that's non-metallic to put the Mach 8 into flash mode. And you'll download this file from in the description, go ahead and insert the SD card and open it. And once you get this file right here downloaded, don't unzip it or anything like that. Just download the file just like it is in the description and slide the zip file onto the SD card and drop it and just wait for the file to copy over. All right, now the zip file is finished copying to the SD card. So go ahead and eject the SD card. Now take the SD card that you just added the firmware to and insert it into the Mach 8. Unplug it from the power and use a matchstick or a toothpick or something non-metallic. And on the back of the device, you'll see an AV input right next to the Ethernet port. Just go ahead and insert that toothpick or matchstick and you'll hear a button click like that. So just go ahead and press it in and hold it and make sure you got it held and insert the power cable and just keep holding the recovery button and wait about 10 to 15 seconds and on your screen you'll see the Android character and you'll know that you did it correctly. Alright now this will be the next screen that you see if you did the process correctly. If you don't see this screen and your device just boots normally then you need to start over and unplug the device and try once again but this is the next screen that you should see I wasn't able to get the remote control that comes with the Mach 8 to work so you're going to need to use either a USB mouse keyboard combo or some kind of air mouse and just go ahead and use that for now but when you see this screen scroll down to apply update from EXT click on that and then click on update from SD card and then find the K200-OTA, make sure you get the one that doesn't have the dot and the underscore at the front. Click on this one and just wait a few seconds and I'll see you as soon as the process is complete. And when you see this on your screen, installing system update, that's how you'll know you did the process correct and I'll see you as soon as the process is finished. Alright, now the process is complete and just go ahead and take the USB mouse and keyboard combo that you're using and go to the reboot system now and this is the next thing you'll see the welcome screen because you'll need to go ahead and set the device up once again just like it's fresh out of the box but it'll be running the latest firmware this time all right, now we've got the Mach 8 set up again. Let's go into the settings and show you that it was it's updated to the latest firmware. So go into your system settings like that and go into other. And you'll see right here where it says kernel version at the bottom. You'll see April 30th. So that lets you know that this is the latest firmware that was released on April 30th, just a few days ago before the making of this video. So now we'll go back and we'll go to my apps and I'll scroll down and show you that it has the Play Store. Scroll down a little more and show you that it also has XBMC. All right, this is Supercharged iOS. This video showed you how to update the Armada Mach 8 to the latest firmware and get the best version of XBMC as well as the Google Play Store work. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. Please like my page at facebook.com forward slash charged iOS. Follow me at twitter.com forward slash charged iOS. If you haven't already subscribed to my other channel, please do at youtube.com forward slash extreme tech global. Thank you guys for watching. See you in the next video. Peace.